by Hannah Torregoza Senate Minority Leader Franklin Drylan downplayed the plunder charges the Department of Transportation, DOTR, officials filed recently against the former officials of the Aquino administration. Drylan said the DOTR should instead concentrate on improving the Metro Rail Transit 3, MRT 3, which has frequently bugged down due to maintenance issues. Senate President Franklin Drylan, Jacqueline Hernandez Manila Bulletin File Photo After almost one year and a half, I suggest to the Department of Transportation that they stop looking for scapegoats and start looking for solutions, Drylan told reporters in an interview. Up to this point, the MRT is still in such a state that it does not serve the purpose for which it was formed, Drylan said. Drylan was reacting to the plunder complaint filed by the Dutch lawyers, acting as complainants, against former Interior Secretary Manuel Mar Roxas II and Transportation Secretary Joseph Emilio June Abaya and other officials over their involvement in the alleged anomalous maintenance contract with Busan Universal Rail, Inc. Bury. Other respondents in the case are former Budget Secretary Florencio Butch Abbott, former Finance Secretary Cesar Purisima, former Energy Secretary Jericho Petala, former Defense Secretary Voltaire Gasman, former Public Works Secretary Rogelio Singson, former Science and Technology Secretary Mario Montejo, and former National Economic Development Authority, NADA, Chief Arsenio Balasakin. Dryland said he is confident that Roxas, Abe, and other respondents in the case would be able to answer the allegations against them. Even then, Dryland said he wonders why plunder cases were filed against the former officials since there is no allegation the respondents profited personally from the maintenance deal with Bury. Plunder requires or one of the elements of the crime is that you personally profited to the extent of P50 million. I don't even think that there is an allegation that these respondents profited personally, he said. Asked if he believes the two former government officials would be vindicated, Dryland said yes. I am confident I have confidence in the integrity of these people, he stressed. Tags, Aquino, Busan Universal Rail, Department of Transportation, Dryland downplays plunder charges versus former Aquino cabinet officials, Franklin Dryland. Manila Bulletin, Mar Roxas 3, MRT 3